got different pepper vine growing right next to each other. This is the one I showed you in a previous video that I've got growing in my backyard. And you can see the berries are starting to develop, but it's still got a while before they ripen. These will turn a dark purple and they'll be two or three times this size. And then we have your heart-shaped pepper vine over here. You can see where it gets its name if you look at the leaf. These berries are starting to develop. Here's one that is fully ripe. And you can have in these clusters all different stages of ripening. Sometimes they'll look kind of whitish before they turn purple. And then they'll turn a deep dark purple once they get fully ripe. This is the plant that most people will confuse with frost grapes because they'll grow around the same time. Frost grapes will not be ripe until the first freeze. But these will ripen pretty soon, late August, mid August here, depending on how much rain we get. The easiest way to tell this from frost grapes is the leaf and the clusters of grapes. So the leaf will be huge on a frost grape. You can see this one's about two or three inches wide and long. And you'll have big clusters, grape-like clusters on the frost grapes when they grow down. And they'll kind of all start to turn the same color at the same time. Make sure when you're harvesting these, you don't get in to any poison oak or poison ivy. So here we've got some poison ivy growing up and it's got berries on it too at this time of year. But you don't wanna rub up against that. It'll have a real hairy like vine. I know that's hard to see. And it'll grow up trunks of trees and you don't want to get in in any of that especially if you're highly allergic to it but always watch out for it because they'll grow in some of the same areas